Hello and welcome. In today's video, we're going to discuss a feature of the grandmother called multi-trig that was added in firmware version 1.1.3. Multi-trig refers to how the envelope re-triggers based on your playing behavior on the keyboard. The default behavior for the grandmother is to have multi-trig turned off, which means when I play legato notes, the envelope will only trigger on the first note and not on any legato playing that happens after it. So let's hear how that sounds. Now if I were to want the envelope to re-trigger on every note, it just means I have to adjust my playing style to be a bit more staccato. So I need to make sure that my finger has lifted off of the key that I pressed previously in order to get the envelope to re-trig. Now multi-trig gets around that and allows for people who maybe don't have great articulation on a keyboard to get the envelope to re-trigger no matter how they play. And to do this, what we need to do is enter the settings menu of the grandmother, which can be accomplished by holding the hold button and the sync button until the sync button starts to blink. And then I'm going to select multi-trig within the menu by hitting F-sharp 2 and then A-sharp 1. You'll notice that the sync button will start blinking slightly differently to indicate the menu selection that you've chosen. And now that I'm in this parameter selection, I can use the bottom two white keys to select whether multi-trig is on or off. F is going to be off and G is going to be on. So I'm going to press G once to select on, and then I'm going to press it again to exit the menu. And now notice when I play in a legato style, the note will re-trigger the envelope every single time I press a new key. This can be a nice way to achieve different styles of articulation on your passages when playing the grandmother. 